was shocked at anything, you know what I'm saying? But I wasn't more shocked at him dying. Then I'll take a few questions from the press, from the press, and if there are no questions, all is good. We'll take some pictures. Thank you very much. Who are you with? I'm with the Young Turks. The undercurrent. Oh yes. Uh, so you had mentioned that you would 40% uh, of energy comes from these two coal uh, power plants, and that uh, one of the sources that you'll use is natural gas. Will the city be obtaining that natural gas through fracking? No, I don't. We won't. Um, the I can tell you uh, that plant will be about 60% the size of the coal plant. We'll also be able, with the, these agreements, to be able to continue to use those transmission lines where we'll uh, be able uh, to bring solar uh, and um, wind power uh, to our city. Thank you very much. I'm with the Young Turks. My name is Lauren Windsor. Very nice to meet you. The undercurrent. So, Mayor, uh, several of the speakers spoke about the urgency of making the transition, uh, going completely coal-free. Why is it going to take 12 years for this transition to occur? Well, we got to. Uh, we have uh, agreements till 2027. So, in order uh, to build uh, the uh, natural gas plant, it's going to take us a period of time to get the permits. Uh, it's th This isn't an easy proposition. It's going to take us some time, uh, but this is probably the most complicated set of agreements that any city is engaged in to get off of coal. Uh, remember, uh, at the IPP plant, we were we had agreements to be with them till 2027. Uh, at the Navajo plant, I believe till 2019. Uh, we'll, we hope to get out of Navajo by 2015, uh, and uh, we hope to be out of IPP by 2025. Uh, what's critical is we're the first city to do this. Uh, we're absolutely committed uh, to uh, this effort, and that's what uh, we're so proud to announce today. So I asked prior about uh, replacing that uh, particular fuel source with natural gas, and you had said that it will not come from fracking. Is well, that correct? The, the None of the natural gas that will replace the coal will come from fracking? Fracking at that site, no. Inside the book of Revelations, demons came from heavenly places, and it makes me wonder if I'm under some sort of spiritual matrix with the truth pulled over my eyes with the evil forces that compromise my state of mind. Have I been hypnotized to believe in lies with the monologue questioning God like Habakkuk? Cause the odds keep stacking up. Where is the illumination for the human nation? We are ruining nations by the moves we're making. They try to search for peace by going to war. It don't make sense like trying to blend oil and water in a...